Hey, what's going on guys? Robert Welton here from CoinOp TV, talking to you a little bit about the Black Friday deals, the purchases that I made, and then I'm hoping that at the end of this video, maybe or while you're watching, you'll let me know in the comments below what kind of cool things you may have gotten for Black Friday, or you think you may have gotten, maybe your folks, or your friends, or relatives may have bought something for you that they're going to keep and, uh, you know, keep wrapped up and uh, let you have maybe for the Christmas tree, uh, you know, later in December. But anyway, I went and scoured, uh, scoured, you know, Fry's and Best Buy, Target, Toys R Us, a few places. And in this video, I mostly want to kind of talk to you about some of the Blu-rays that I picked up just because they were kind of fun movies and for very cheap. So that's what I'm going to do, talk about in this video. So let me start off with, I uh, picked up Olympus Has Fallen. This is Gerard Butler, Morgan Freeman, Aaron Eckhart. It's an action movie, uh, rated R. <laughs> so uh, some of these movies are rated R. I got some PG movies here, but this was eight bucks, eight bucks, seven ninety nine, I think. And uh, you know, I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, Anton Fuqua, director. He's done a lot of really great action movies. It was terrorists invading the White House. Very well done. I never saw this in the theaters, but I heard they're going to make a sequel to Olympus Has Fallen. So I'm hoping to see Olympus Has Fallen, the sequel, in the movie theaters. And I thought, you know, what better way to, you know, rev up for that than by having the first movie there to kick things off. So next up, I picked up The Town. This is another rated R movie. A couple rated R uh, movies here. This is from uh, director Ben Affleck. And it's got uh, Ben Affleck and um, John Hamm, Jeremy Renan. Uh, Renner, also known as Hawkeye from the Avenger movies. Now this is the extended cut right there. This was um, six bucks, I think, at Fry's. I think I got um, all these at Fry's, these Blu-rays in this video. So six bucks, the town. Uh, these guys um, dress up as sort of nuns and they rob uh, banks and bank robbers. But it's more about kind of the personal relationships with buddies, brothers, their neighborhood, what's going on. Uh, okay, next up, I picked up The Wolf of Wall Street. Leo DiCaprio, this is directed by uh, Martin Scorsese, one of my favorite uh, film directors. Uh, it's basically about a guy who just um, can figure out the tricks of Wall Street and to make money and become really a solid uh, player in the uh, industry of Wall Street and stuff like that. A lot of sex, drugs, rock and roll in this, definitely rated R. I'm not sure if this is even, yeah, it says rated R on the back there. A lot of stuff going on in this movie. If you're young, not for you. Actually, I think all these movies may be rated R, so. Uh, so here's one, Kevin Costner, Waterworld. This I got for four bucks. This was considered like a giant flop or a big disaster when it originally came out. Um, oh, this was PG-13. Uh, let's see, what year was this? Gosh, it might have been like the late 80s or whatever, but Kevin Costner was sort of given a ton of money. Uh, Kevin Reynolds, the director, and they sort of made this movie. It was supposed to be like the next big action thing that everybody loved and it didn't really turn out that way but for four bucks I thought it was sort of a fun movie to have and visually I think it still kind of holds up it's a little cheesy and weird and it's funny seeing Kevin Costner as kind of this um uh you know savior of the uh you know this barren wasteland kind of thing going on in there but for four bucks hey you know it's worth checking out uh, here's another one I got for four bucks, Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. First of all, if you've never seen any of the Indiana Jones movies, uh, the first one is the best. Temple of Doom is really fun. A lot of people like three, uh, second best, and then the fourth one, the Crystal Skull, that's the one with the nuke the fridge and all that nonsense going on. This is PG, directed by Steven Spielberg. Um, you know, I guess we're getting excited for, um, you know, the new Star Wars movies. Maybe you want to sort of go back and visit uh, some of the Harrison Ford era with the Indiana Jones classics. If you haven't seen that, four bucks. Not bad. All right, so this was a find here. Uh, this is the um, Riddick Complete Collection. This is all three movies, uh, Pitch Black, The Chronicles of Riddick, and Riddick, the third movie, and also the animated uh, series, uh, which is called... I forgot what it was called, but there was like an animated thing. I haven't seen it yet. Uh, the World of Riddick, I'm not quite sure. But anyway, it has all three of those movies. Now, here's what I'm gonna say about this. This was $18.99, I think, and it retails normally for like 35 bucks. So to get it for under 20 bucks, really cool. Uh, these I'm pretty sure are all rated R. And uh, if you guys are Vin Diesel fans, maybe you haven't seen Pitch Black. It came out quite a while ago, over 10 years ago. Pitch Black was the first one. It's really, really great. He's very moody, not very talkative. Um, you know, we like I like Vin Diesel when he's not that talkative, when he's playing Groot, the voice of Groot, 
or the Iron Giant. So, so as the character Riddick, not quite that talkative. Very action-packed, science fiction. So the first movie, Pitch Black, is great. The second one, Chronicles of Riddick, not really that great. Pass on that. But then the third movie, Riddick, big giant thumbs up, really action-packed, really lots of fun. So uh, the only thing I haven't seen on here yet is the animated movie. And one more, last but not least, what some people may hail as the greatest movie of all time. is definitely one of the highest grossing movies of all time. Have you guys ever seen Titanic? So actually I got two Leo DiCaprio movies, this and The Wolf of Wall Street. Titanic for four bucks, remaster on Blu-ray, um, and digital copy and all that. Now this is, this is going to be PG, PG-13. If you haven't seen Titanic, you know, a lot of you guys may be like, oh, Rob, thumbs down, fail, whatever, cheesy movie. It's a high quality movie, really well done. And the second half of the movie, when the ship is sinking and going down, things just look crazy. The reason why I wanted to pick this up, and it was four bucks, I like the movie when I originally saw it. I think it still holds up over time, but I've never listened to the uh, disc. It's got the uh, James Cameron, so this is a James Cameron movie. James Cameron is one of my favorite film directors, and it's got a commentary on here. And as a film guy, production guy, I like to. Um, watch movies and have like the commentary on there talking about the movies and stuff like that. So that's why I want to pick up Titanic, four bucks, it was cheap. So here's what I want you guys to do if you're watching this video at home, on your phone, your YouTubes, your internets, your website, let me know in the comments below what kind of things did you guys get for Black Friday, if it was movies, toys, anime, you know, just let me know. And maybe if you just hung out with your family and had some food, enjoyed some turkeys, some some bread, some muffins, some cookies, some crackers, whatever. Just talk about some of your Thanksgiving holiday, Black Friday 2014 fun that you had so we can, uh, you know, just kind of communicate a bit. Thanks a bunch for watching this video. We'll see you guys next time.